guys what's good what's good um today is thursday and i decided to do another weekend with me blog vlog <laughs> um it's beyond freezing in my house so cold that my toes are frozen like seriously i know you can't see my feet but i got boots on and my toes are frozen anywho i'm about to head out <coughs> excuse me and i'm freaking starving it's like nine o'clock and i haven't eaten all day so i'm going to look in the kitchen see what i can take with me and i'll warm it up when i get to long island i'll see you guys when i get in the car or after okay so i'm about to head out i just stuffed my face with a little bit of something before i get on the road um i packed a little goodie bag so i can share the goods with my sister and um yeah i'm gonna prepare for tomorrow so come on let's go y'all i just remembered that i had a flat tire like two days ago and i'm about to ride on the highway for about a good 45 minutes to an hour i have no means of getting my tire fixed if I'm stuck on the road I'll be stuck on the road with nada not a penny so you guys I know I can't ask you to wish me luck but I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know that I'm terrified <laughs> but um yeah and I'm freezing so I'm waiting for the car to kind of warm up I just left the gas station so um yeah I'm not looking forward to this ride let me put on my freaking bifocals so I can see. All right, y'all. See you in a little bit. God willing. Hey, guys. I made it safely. It was an hour drive. And I'm so blessed. I was just snacking on the best Doritos ever created. Mm. Mm. I wish I had another bag. I feel so fat. But yeah, I'm about to go inside. It's cold, but it feels so warm in this car. I don't want to get out. But yeah, I'll see you in a minute. I was just blog vlogging and talking. And this whole time, I thought my sister wasn't in the room. And I was waiting, looking outside the door for her to walk in so I can record her. And guess what? She was right there the whole time. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really out of it. I'm out of it. But yeah, like I said, I think I'm freaking a vampire. Or I just have sleep issues or whatever. Hey, you didn't say good morning. Say good morning. Okay, I'll show you her when she gets ready. I'm feeling blue, I'm feeling ugly, my hair is whack, my hair is thin, I look like a rag doll that's lost most of its hair, or a mop that lost most of its mop string, whatever. I need to go to sleep, guys. <laughs> Seriously, I don't know what to do. Uh, maybe I should take a Benadryl or just eat something because the itis always helps just thinking about food is making me tired but I would want to eat something really heavy like fried chicken mmm let me go yeah <laughs> I'm not getting the bed. You just gave like a fake high, like you know, with the fake white people hey smile. Guys, what's going on? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how real to make it. Sorry. I thought you were an actress. I know, but that was my actress. Hello. Vagina monologue. Oh, she thinks she's all that with those nerdy glasses. These aren't nerdy. 
these are trendy. Not trendy, trendy. Okay. Remember that. <sighs> I want to go to sleep, but it's not working. What earrings are you wearing today? No. I don't wear earrings anymore because all my earrings are trash. They're fucking ugly. So I don't have nothing to wear. Why are they trash? They're just whack and old. So get rid of them. Have a good one. Never mind. What? <laughs> okay, let me leave you alone. <laughs> That's me with the big ears. <laughs> I look funny, right? You want to go downstairs and go look for some snacks? Sure. <laughs> okay, let's go. She thinks I'm weird. <laughs> wow. I didn't need you to never do that again. <laughs> Why? Wow. Did you get scared? No. <laughs> what? I really didn't see you. You didn't see me. Tell the truth. I didn't. I was <laughs> you know I'm like mad bored, right? Wrong impression. Yeah, still haven't slept yet. I'm outside doing something I shouldn't be doing. <laughs> but yeah, um, my food is probably like burning right now. So we'll find out when I get back inside the house. So it doesn't smell like it burnt. Let's see if it burnt. Not really. I burped. Excuse me, y'all. If you're wondering what this is, my my godmother, she likes to make shit from scratch or whatever, so she made some patties, and she calls them her Haitian Jamaican patties, and then her son calls it Haitian empanada, whatever, but yeah, I'm about to put some cheese in there. I wish it was like the, the stringy cheese. Matter of fact, bump that. I'm going to use this kind. And then I'm going to have the itis, and then I will fall asleep. Okay, guys? See you later. I'm starting to get tired, guys. Okay. As I'm freaking making a fool of myself and wasting my freaking sleep time, I'm going to watch this right here. Y'all can't see it. I don't know. Whatever. But it's called Come Take a Walk With Me. I like watching it. Y'all don't need to know what is it, what it's about unless you go watch it yourself. <laughs> but I want to give a shout out to this handsome young man here. His name is Jay Mugga. Hey, this video is going to be okay. kind of different. So anyway, gonna gonna this guy... Jay Mugga. I met him on Blog TV a few months back. He's pretty cool. Um, he follows me on YouTube. He gave me a shout out, which was so sweet. And um, I follow his vlogs. And he made a vlog that was like, he totally got like my utmost respect. And I just wanted to share him with you guys. So if you ever have a chance, check out Jay Mugga. And you can check out all his videos and see right here he made a little vlog for me when he went to Wendy's <laughs> yeah guys so I'm starting to get tired and it's crazy how I just takes place so fast like I haven't even finished my food and I'm already starting to get tired so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to finish this and then watch that little web series that I just showed you and I'm going to doze off, try to wake up at like maybe 12, take a shower, and then try to prepare 
I might take this out although a lot of y'all probably wondering am I trying to grow dreads my hair is too thin right now for me to do, do dreads and it shrinks way too much so I'm probably gonna take it out and then get ready to go to this damn fucking show oh, I'll see you guys later I'm tired <laughs> hey I know I look a hot mess I know my breath stinks and I know that I'm pissed off at myself for not sleeping because my cousin will be here in one hour I have to take a shower I have to comb my hair and I have to fix these stupid pictures all in one hour yay me now I gotta hurry up and get ready. So I'll see you later. You just can't park? And I can't multitask either. <laughs> no, if she doesn't look over her shoulder, you she doesn't check out the lights. Lights? It's, it's on here, it says it's a 2 for 12, it's actually a 2 for 10. Yeah, it's a 2 for 10, it says it in the book. Hey guys, so, we just got back from Fridays. It's past midnight. My belly is full. And I have to be back at the school tomorrow at 1 o'clock. So I'm going to try to go to sleep. My sister's already in bed. Do you have school? I mean, work? No. Oh. She looks cute even with her head tied. But she's probably going to be mad at me if I record her. But anyways, um, the show was great tonight. The food at Friday's was great. The waitress was a bitch. And I'm rocking an Entree LS wannabe snapback. But my sister says it's a five pack wannabe snapback. We it's a, a snap tell me it's again, a what's it called? Five panel. Uh, it's a five panel. You see this right here? I don't know what that means. But that entree hat right here is the bomb. This color. <laughs> Did I just, I hate when I say the bomb. Uh, I was about to say snapbacks and tattoos. But what's it called again? Five panel. A f five panel and tattoos. Five panel and tattoos. <laughs> ah, ow. You guys, okay, I'm bored. Um, let me go to sleep. I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Friday. Tomorrow, Saturday. Peace. Today's Friday, right? Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so today is the last day of the show. And I am on my way out to do some makeup. Kind of tired. Hungry. But yeah, let's go. We're kind of late.
At least we're gonna be late if we don't leave now. I must admit that I am a thrifting addict because I'm supposed to be at the school at one o'clock. It's now 12.55 and I'm running to a thrift store to look at some jewelry. Um, so, yeah, I have a problem. I got a fucking problem. <laughs> I'll be back. No, matter of fact, yeah, I'll see you when the show is over probably. So, I literally spent two minutes inside the thrift store. I only really went for jewelry. But when I got in there, there were two old Caucasian women at the desk and they acted like I was non-existent. I was like, hi, good afternoon, hello. And I got nothing, so I just stood there and rolled my eyes. So then, <laughs> one of them got up and was like, can I help you? I was like, yeah, can I see those earrings? And then I just paid for my stuff and then I was like, have a great day. I didn't get a response, but anywho, um, I hate going to little like thrift stores where older women are working because I tend to get a lot of them that seem to be prejudiced. I hate making assumptions, but that's what it seems like in my opinion, whatever. Um, so yeah guys, I'm on my way to the school. I should be there in like five minutes. Can't wait till I'm done with the makeup because it takes so much time. So much, it's ridiculous. But yeah, um, this is my last day and I can't wait till it's over, yay! show is over. You're the most prettiest thing. Look, say hi. Hello. Look at your earrings and let me show your sparkly shoes. Yeah. Sparkle for me. Hit them. Go like this. They don't do that. <laughs> they look sparkly. Yeah, well the show is over. Polly over. I'm gonna miss everyone. I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> Um, yeah, guys, I'm going to clean up and get ready to I'm making That's my name. I'm a miss, right? Am I married? You know? <laughs> You're going to be famous. I'm going to miss you. Don't worry. A lot. We're going to be on a road together. Yes. <laughs> now you might even have to worry. Yes. I am. Like, if I seriously get famous, I don't trust anyone else. You're my boo. Give me a hug. Come here. Where's Leo Vada? She's my Capricorn. My Capricorn bestie. If you don't come to me, I will come to you. My Capricorn bestie. My breath smells like onion. Oh, my. <laughs> Sorry. I'm telling me. I'm going to I'm going to miss y'all so much. I'm going to miss y'all so much. All up in your booty. What's up, I'm going to miss y'all. Um, congratulations. This is your last year. It's my last year. My last show. Yes. We want a picture last with you. Can I get a picture with Diane? Yes. Yes. <laughs> party for the cast and crew at one of the students' home. I'm here with a few other the teachers of high school. We're just having a good time. I'm so mad because I recorded them doing the wobble and doing all this funny stuff and the camera was not actually taking it. So I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know that I'm having a good time. I'm trying to get back to Connecticut tonight to go to a party that's supposed to be live as ever. So hopefully I will make it there and I'll see you. And um, yeah, if I make it there, you're gonna come with me. I'm about to go. I'm in New York right now and I'm about to head out. It's 11 o'clock. I'm gonna try to get there by 12. Get ready, get it on and pop in and I'm taking y'all to a party with me. You ready? You ready? Don't lie to me. You ready? Let go. So, it's 12.19 a.m. and I was supposed to be at a party in Connecticut. I'm in Long Island, New York right now, an hour away. Now, I have to get to Connecticut, get ready, get dressed to go 
to this party. The party ends at 3 o'clock in the morning. I am going to see if I could do this with you guys with me. Um, I was supposed to leave since 10 o'clock, but my uncle, who really rarely ever talks to me, actually had a good conversation with me, and I got so much from that conversation that it brought tears to my eyes. Like, I really would have never expected him to take the time to talk to me. So for that, I appreciate it. So I ended up staying for that extra time. And mind you, I take everything as a sign. He's talking to me now. I'm gonna gain something from that. I could have told him I have somewhere to go, but I didn't. So I'm not even gonna, you know, make a big deal that I missed out on this party. I'll go there, show up for like an hour or two, and I'll be good, you know what I mean? Oh, by the way, um, I ended up getting um, a gift from one of the teachers. She gave me a bottle of wine and a beautiful card. So, yeah, I did a great job. And hopefully this will take me somewhere. I am really good at doing makeup. I never knew that until tonight. All the compliments I got. But, yeah, I'll see you guys when I get back to CT. Peace out. Oh, I pray to God that I make it back safely. <laughs> I'm a little disappointed. I thought I was going to get home in time and get dressed by 1.30. No. It is 1.52. And yes, I am still headed to that party. <laughs> um, I just need to, needed to throw on some glasses so I can see while I'm driving. The party is about 15 minutes away from me. Probably less than that. Um, so yeah, let me get off this cam so I can go ahead and get there. Um, I'm so disappointed. If it weren't for me having a conversation with my uncle that took like an hour, I would have been here at 12.53 instead of 1.53. But everything happens for a reason, so I'm going to take it in stride and just enjoy my little hour. You know what I'm saying? So I'll see you guys when I get there. <laughs> so it's two o'clock and I'm just getting here. Let's see if they let me in. I made it in. Woo I made it in. Yeah, so what? I got one hour to party, but I'm going to enjoy every last bit. Y'all can't see me, but I just want to let you guys know that I made it in. It's 3.57 a.m. The party was over a while ago, but um, somebody pulled me aside and um, was talking to me about something. So I'm on my way home, but before I go home, I'm going to run to the bank and put all the money that I made today <laughs> in there so I can pay the cable bill. Um, the last time you guys heard from me last week, uh, I was supposed to pay the cable bill, but because I didn't pay it on time, I then had to pay an additional 200 and something. So, yeah, my cable bill is 600 and something dollars for you guys. I know, a little bit too much information, but you know, I don't care. So, all right. Well, I'm hoping that I get home safely after getting to the bank. I'm about to hop on the highway, so see you when I get home. God willing. <laughs> So I just recorded the ending to my vlog video twice and it did not take. So I'll do this for the last time. I thank you for watching me throughout my Thursday and Saturday. It is now Sunday, 6 a.m. 
my day is going to be consisted of me sleeping my ass off so I doubt that you want to see that so I'm going to end it right here right now um, I had a great time tonight uh, although I didn't get to party as much as I wanted to I did make an appearance it was crazy because it's like I've seen so many people um, gave so many hugs out it was awesome um, you guys didn't get to see what it was like in there because it was so dark at the moment so I didn't film it uh, I had a wonderful experience with the high school students I'm gonna miss them to death some of them more than the others they know who they are um, yeah I mean this was a wonderful thing I have to pay my cable bill like ASAP because I need my internet I don't care about the TV but um I need the internet for real for real for real for real tired of going on my phone my arms are tired and I am tired as well and hungry I'm trying to suppress my hunger by thinking about other shit but it's not working I'm like two seconds away from going downstairs and getting something to eat but I don't know my belly is ridiculous I wore a girdle today and that shit didn't even work y'all it didn't even work I'm so mad about that too much information right <laughs> but yeah guys I'm freezing cold I'm trying to warm up so um, yeah, I'll see you on the next video It'll probably be my love and hip-hop review and um, if you want to follow me next weekend let me know in the comments below if you want to see what I do next weekend I'm actually planning to go to this place called SOB's in Manhattan so if you want to follow me let me know and I'll do exactly what you ask peace not everything though don't get it twisted I'll catch you on the next bit <laughs> I had to come back on here because this is fucking crazy Okay, so I just got off the video and I told you I had to pay my cable bill. It's like six hundred plus dollars, but the minimum I had to pay was like four twenty five. And I kid you not, the second I put the payment in, like you can't see the time. Like when you have a cable box from Optimum, you see the time. And once they cut off your cable, it just goes blank. You can't see shit. And the minute I hit send it goes your cable um will be restored within 15 minutes i looked and the time was already back on these mother efforts know what they're doing they really do but yeah i'm so happy i'm back in business so that means that i can make videos for you guys without having to go to anybody else's house and i can do my reviews without having to watch the shit at other people's crib so yeah i just wanted to share that with y'all cable is a motherfucker because the bill every month is 213 and um, I have a few TVs in the house that are not being occupied so maybe they need to go right yeah yeah, yeah. they need to go but I just want to share that with y'all I'm so excited I got my cable back and I don't really care about the TV all I care about is the internet I really do I mean who lives without the internet nowadays even my dad knows how to use the internet <laughs> and he's like 60 something <laughs> but yeah guys um, I guess I'll see you in the next video it's Sunday and I'm doing exactly what I told you I would do nothing yes it's a lazy Sunday for me um, I have so much things that I could have done a lot of cleaning to do a lot of washing of clothes and getting rid of junk that I'm attached to you might as well call me a borderline hoarder but uh, I don't want to put that on myself Lord please help me in my time of need I got to get rid of a lot of stuff because um, when you get rid of junk in your life it kind of helps to you know I don't know the words I suck at words guys but when you literally clean it helps you like you feel so much better, you feel like you want to do more, you want to go outside and you want to smell the fresh air and do other shit, you know, but when you're confined to your home and your home is just piled up with a bunch of shit that reminds you of shit, you're gonna feel like shit, so cut the shit and clean, 
that's what I need to do. So I will be doing that tomorrow. Yeah, if you guys don't understand what the shit, what <laughs> I'm saying, shit, my breath probably smells like shit. <laughs> but um, you know when you don't eat all day, you get that stink breath. Yeah, I think I have that. Thank God you can't smell it through this um, camera screen. But anyhow, I'm gonna go because I'm making a fool of myself as I always do. But I really don't give a fuck. And you already know that. So for the people that do watch me and follow my weekend vlogs, vlogs, I gotta get used to that fucking word. Um, I appreciate you taking the time to do so. It means a lot to me when you guys say that you want to see what the hell I'm doing because I be like yo I'm boring what the fuck why do you care what I'm doing but you know what it makes me feel good it does <laughs> you guys are awesome and I don't know what I would do without y'all I really don't I just re would really just be boring like bored anywho I'll see you next vid let me set the record straight for some of you who are watching and judging me and talking shit saying how dare she come on camera looking as hot as her breath hmm really who does she think she is well i just want you to know that I do this and I don't care.